everybody, this is Joel and Paul from Moving to Mexico. Bienvenidos a nuestro canal and bienvenidos to another episode of Taco Tuesday. Good hey, job. how's that for an intro, Paul? I just rolled in and did it. I know, that's what I was thinking we'd do. Uh, isn't that I saw uh, uh, you were Kelly. My, yeah. She showed up a little early. I said, you know what? Let's see if Joel can read my mind, and you yeah, did. There we go. Good job. Good minds think alike, bro. Okay, well, let's uh, get you all in for a well-deserved breakfast. You, just, you don't have to bring your bike inside. Yeah, we did a nice ride through the valley. We added a bunch of gravel. It was fun. Just anywhere there? Yeah. All right, we're going to go for some desayun. I've never been here, Paul. Me neither. And it was, I've uh, heard good things, though. Daniela's suggestion, and Julian has eaten here once before. Okay. Do you think I could get the Nino pricing? Uh, I don't know. You have to be you have to be this tall. We also have supposedly good pancakes here, but no tacos, Paul. But it's okay. Taco Tuesday. If we fold the pancake in half and just fill it with butter and syrup, it's kind of like that a taco, taco, right? I've got like so much work, man. Like <laughs> I shouldn't even be on a ride today. So I got my first possessions today. Oh, okay. So and of course, like, I'm trying to send a message, but it's just connecting. You know, that's happening. How to many me bars all. you got? I got three, but it's like I'm gonna have to turn my phone off. Nadia, can you tell Tremi to get all the workers with their frickin' vehicles off the parking? Unless they're delivering something, I don't want anything there. Like, we have deliveries oh, coming, meter. we have Nitro. stuff that we're doing today. I can't have their shit mobiles there. Like, can you just Jennifer. tell them to move? All their workers cannot park on site unless they're actually leader. delivering something. Por favor. I'm not gonna make that meeting at 12. I'm gonna be there at 12.30. If you want to get started, it doesn't matter. Like you can read all the contracts. I'm going to come just sign the papers anyways, which is probably not going to be till one o'clock. So if you can maybe go to my house, you can grab my purse and my passport, my ID, everything's in there. You can get the process started and I will be there at 1230. Sound good? Thank you. That's a little flavor of, of Joel's life right now, right? Yeah, that's the flavor of my life. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, you know, like we're trying to have possessions and then I have people delivering stuff today yeah. and all the workers, like, yeah. freaking cars are like parked yeah. in front of Quattro. Like, get them, you can't park there. Yeah. That's not a parking spot. Right. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so I, I maybe it was a little harsh, but I had to get the message across. Sometimes you gotta crack that whip, right? Gotta crack the whip. And I have to be somewhere at noon. And it's 11.21. Oh, you're good. Yeah. <laughs> See, my crazy. phone's just starting to go crazy now, right? <laughs> I'm to have to apologize to early because it's like... Oh, I think it's yeah. entertaining. Is it entertaining? Yeah, for me it is. Yeah. <laughs> like, everyone's, like, going crazy this morning. Yeah. Like, I'm like, why am I... How come I'm on a ride? Well, because I, I have this job, too. Right. Like, there was no one else to do it. Yeah. So then Jillian stepped up today to kind of like oversee some of the last minute things sure. with the possessions, which she wants no part of. Right. right but I'm like, honey, like, There's throw me a solid here. Like, do me a solid. Gracias. And I'll get everyone to uh, place their orders uh, when you're ready, okay? Um, just because I think this is kind of like made to order. Unfortunately, I have to be at a, a lawyer's appointment by 12.30. Well, it's just, I'm not, I don't normally rush anything, but today I'm going to have to do that to you guys. But Paul said it's entertaining. It's entertaining to see Joel kind of like take frantic. Take the tab and handle it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. So you think this is a taco? Well, it's close enough. Looks like these are freshly made, huh? Mm, they are. Yeah. So you got the breakfast sandwich, Joel. I did. How's that taco? It's good. It's um, well, we'll call it a torta. Yeah, it's kind of. I've been on the egg sandwich. 
kick lately. Okay. I, we make a lot of egg sandwiches at home. Cool. I it's usually an make easy one. one. It's an easy one. They gave me plenty of butter and syrup. It looks legitimate. 841 pesos. 841 pesos, and how many people uh, did we feed here? One, two, three, six, seven, eight. Eight people. So it's 100 pe pesos each. It's pretty good. Yeah. So that's uh, that's five bucks a person. Yeah, you can't go wrong. This is this this is the new spot. And they have like a breakfast special too. I think you get like, ca I don't know. Like, it looks like a big breakfast for 150 pesos. Yeah. Like, but it's, I don't know. Everyone got a drink, uh, agua fresca or a coffee. Wow. Well, and can't go wrong. This is not too far from Cuatro Estaciones area. Right? Yeah, so the, the new people who have bought a Cuatro, you can come here for for breakfast, do a little walk. Yeah. Um, we'll come back. We'll, let's come back and try. We're gonna try their mollete. Yeah. And I'll try their. Uh, well, you had the pancakes. Pancakes are good. I'll try the burrito. Burritos look good. Did everybody enjoy their meal? Very good. Yeah. A few moments later. I was talking to the air. Ah. Uh, Nadia? We have a firm with the notary. 29? What is her name? Joel. They are waiting for me. Okay. One moment, please. It's like... You want to ask? Okay. So a lot of way it works in Mexico is like I'm literally here signing the deed, uh -huh. and we make the payment the moment I sign it. Oh, I see. Okay. It's like and then they sign, pay, and then they see that they look at their bank account and they see that it paid, and then they sign. Oh, I see. Yeah. It's like a little bit old school, but back in the day, I'd have like a big bag of cash here. Oh, right. Like I push the cash <laughs> on the table. Yeah. Right. And back in the day, when like still kind of like that. Kind of. There's electronic money. Right. Then it'll be digital money. It'll, we'll be paying with Bitcoin or something. Yeah. No, except the government will control that. Yeah. It'll be government Bitcoin. The only scary thing about that one is you try to just pay from your wallet, and they're saying, eh, 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 eh. you don't have your. Uh, your green credits, you know, right. your, your carbon your, tax, your carbon, you, you, your you, carbon you, points. You, you spend too much carbon, so therefore to make this transfer you owe. Yeah, and then you just five thousand dollars, and yeah. then you have to accept it to pay. Like that's the future, but not right now. No. So Nadia was sweet. She came in in advance, reviewed everything, so I don't have to read it. She's already done that. Cool. Gracias, Nadia. She's got our banking information up right now. One point, well, one point something million pesos. Okay. Pesos. So that you, right now, this is the purchase for the house across the street from Joel's wine bar. That's right. Okay. So uh, we're excited about that. Cool. And Nadia is going to be my partner on it. So Very we're exciting. Doing a joint project. <laughs> cool. Today was a. Today seems kind of crazy, and I've seen you in stressful moments yeah. and you seem pretty good yeah. you seem pretty chill yeah. so it, good good job Joel it's stressful but you just gotta roll with it yeah like I was up at um, 5 30 this morning yeah maybe just before so I just, just I wanted to start my day I knew I had a big day yeah so just like took my time to get ready and kind of like thought about things right yeah it's better when you do that, like, because we had some stressful moments trying to get the cyclist going today, and it was like, normally, in past times, I may have, like, not dealt with it as the same, uh -huh. or as good, yeah. but today it was like, okay, yeah. deep breath, yeah. we'll, we'll, it'll all work out. You set your, uh, you set your intention early set your in intention. the day to not have too many freak out moments. Exactly. Okay. So normally this is the situation that you come to the notary 
and you sit at a table like this. And we have the, the owners across the table yeah. from us, but we're not putting them on camera, yeah. obviously. And then you have the representative from the notary. Yeah. Or so the I thought he was a doctor. Is he a doctor? No, yeah, he had a surgical mask on. This is like a coffee. Oh, okay. So we can review it if there is a mistake. Right. This isn't the escritura. No, the opening. Oh, but we're going to sign that today too. Yes. Oh, okay. What's, What's going on, Joel? Oh, so this is just the contract, so I was just asking that. The escritura, I still have to review. Mm -hmm. But we're going to call Intercam right now to, can, to tell them to release the money because they're holding it. Oh, okay. So that'll happen sometimes too. Yeah, you know, it's good that the bank's doing that though. Yeah, they don't just let money fly around everywhere. Yeah, make sure this is legitimate. So I'm, uh, I am had to answer the security questions. Oh, you weren't recording that, were you? No, I didn't oh, okay, record it. Um, so they'll just, they confirmed it's me, now they're going to confirm the deposit, they should release it, and then we should be off to the races. Yeah, I think we're down to the wiring quattro today. First two guests arriving today. Oh my gosh. And one of the units has to be fully furnished, which we've been working on, but it's like, so, so I had the furnishing guys come yesterday, but then the blinds guys showed up. So then they took, they were just like in all the, all the space. Yeah. So we had to clean up after them. Well, they right. Right? Because they still leave yeah. a, a disaster they a behind. They make a yeah. mess. And, uh, so they had to do the final like furnishing because then we pulled the mattresses and one of the mattresses got wet along the side. I don't, we don't even know how. How is this possible? Weird, huh? It was in, it's not locked raining. in an apartment and it hasn't been raining and there's no water in the apartment. So we're like, how is this wetness. possible? And it, it's clean water and it's not soaked into the mattress just along the side. Yeah. But it's still... Now the money went through. Yeah, it's in their account. Cool. Now, next is we gotta wait for the escritura, not even? Yep. Okay. That could take another hour. Yeah. Right. No? Mm -hmm. When I first bought a house here, it was it's something like that. Yeah. We were in that notary all afternoon. Was that for Casita Adelaide? Casita Adelaide, yeah. yeah. And then when my friends ended up buying half from us, the uh -huh. same exact thing happened. Yeah. When they bought half. I like it. So it just like ruined the whole day. Yeah, it's, it's basically when you do this, it could take a whole day. It could Just plan on that. Don't make plans. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Muchas gracias. Mm. Well? Double purse day for Joel. I got Joel. double purse day because yeah, what happened was so I so down to the wire. I told Nadia go to my house and grab my bag because I have my I happen to have my passport in there and my my ID from the other day. Yeah. Because we were at the same notary, and I said I'll just save me time and you can kind of get there and get started on the photocopies. Sure. Um, but that was pretty painless. Yeah. I mean we were in and out in uh, maybe an hour. Adios, Nadia. Less than an hour. Um, yeah, I'll come with you. Bye, Nadia. Bye. <laughs> All right, so uh, thanks again for joining us. I hope you saw what it was kind of like to go to a notary and close a real estate deal. That was a pretty painless situation. Start to finish, if I came when Nadia came, was an hour and a half. It's not, it's not it bad at all. It wasn't so bad. And yeah. there's a lot less signing now, so I thought yeah. that was great. Uh, before I sign off, we were going to pick a day for the the open house that's, meet for you. That's right. January. January 14th, which is a Saturday. Okay. Yeah, I think that'll be right in the middle of the month and a lot of people that should be expressed interest to come in January. Okay. So long. We'll send out a registration thing. Well, I'll create a page where you can register. Um, yeah, because we're going to do it at Paul's Cafe. Right? Yes, because we're going to have to order food and we have some tents. So We'll have to have a, a good RSVP list right. to know who's coming. All right, everybody. Uh, thanks again for joining us uh, for this episode here at MoveToMexico.co. Nos vemos hasta luego. And adios desde Bustrias, Mexico. Y notario 29.